The leaf of the mulberry tree is the caterpillar's only food. Here, the children are gathering leaves from a tea's weeping mulberry tree. This tree does not grow very tall and is often used for beautifying parkways. Here is another kind of mulberry tree which grows very tall. This leaf is from a tea's weeping mulberry tree. Note that it is small, long, and narrow. These large leaves are from the tall mulberry tree. They contain less juice than the small variety, but appear much earlier in the spring as the time comes for the hatching of the silk moth egg. is removed as a skein of silk.